So, this shit takes stuck. What is glue? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have Emily here with me today and we're gonna be doing a New Year's Eve slash New Year's look and it's gonna be a very glam as you can tell with a neutral lip and she is a beginner in makeup so gotta be patient with that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I think, no, she'll do great, she'll do great. Well, I mean, clearly... We already did this, but we're just, you know, I'm talking shit. But, um, <laughs> anyway, yeah, so if you guys would like to see how we got this look, then please keep watching. Okay, so we're going to start off with our eyebrows, and I'm going to be using the Anastasia Brow Powder Duo in the shade Ebony. There's a, whatever, a reflection on that. And then Emily is going to be using... It's um, called MAC shape and shade brow tint yeah and that's what it is it's like a little pencil and so what you want to do is just like start outlining your brow and then you just want to fill it in and that's, that's how you do it So now moving on to eyes, we're going to start by priming our lids and we're going to be using the Tarte Shape Tape. And she has her Shape Tape too. I hate when I put so much. I think I put too much too, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you definitely did. <laughs> you went like... I'm like, I think I put too much... <laughs> that was so funny. That was a rookie mistake. Clearly, I'm a rookie. So for our eyeshadow, we're going to be using the Nightingale Pretty Vulgar Eyeshadow Palette. We're going to be starting off with the color Hide and Seek for transition. This one right here. So you want to pick it up and then you're going to go into the crease. I'm like looking over there as if I had a mirror over there. I'm like, yeah, into the crease. <laughs> Just uh, like here. Yeah, you go into the crease and then like circular motions and then just go back and forth. So next, we're going to be using the shade Flip Out, which is this darker brown right here. And we're just gonna use a less fluffier brush, so one like that. Would it be that one? So a less fluffy brush, yeah, that's fine. And we're just gonna put the shade right below the shade we placed before. Okay, so for our eyelids, I'm gonna be using. <laughs> she means we are gonna be using. We're gonna be using the Jelly Pong Pong pigment in the shade Pulsar. So it's like this blue pigment. We're gonna be using our fingers to apply that. Okay, so for the outer corner, we're gonna use this little, this shade called Swoop on the palette with an even smaller fluffy brush. This one, you wanna go like super lightly, so get like a little bit, cause this one's way darker. Just focus it on the outer corner. So since this is a New Year's look, you want to be extra and glam. So we're going to do some glitter. And we're starting off with the NYX Glitter Primer. And we're going to be using the NYX Glitter and it's in the shade Crystal. Ooh. So we're just going to be using a small brush like that. You could use a concealer brush too. And you just 
you want to be really careful to where you place the glue on your eye because the glitter will stick to wherever you put the glue. So we're gonna be using the Baddington lashes and the style is the Monroe <laughs> 3D silk lashes before lashes we're gonna be using mascara and this is the it Superhero Mascara by It Cosmetics. We're gonna be using the Strip Lash <laughs> Adhesive to put it on... <laughs> We're gonna be using the Strip Lash Adhesive as the glue for eyelashes. <laughs> So we're just gonna be placing it on the lash and then we're just gonna, with our fingers, we're just gonna put it on our eyes and accommodate them. Wow! Okay, so we're finally done with our eyes. We've got our lashes on and onto the face now. So it's like flying over here, but you know what? We're leaving it like that because it was a little bit of a struggle to put on, so. <laughs> that was a huge no, 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 That's not going anywhere. So we're going to be using the Luminizer Primer by Dr. Brandt. Okay, so for foundation, I'm going to be using the It Cosmetics CC Cream. And Emily is going to be using... The True Match Lumi mixed in with the Makeup Forever. <gasps> I didn't wet it! Ah! I haven't wet mine either. Oh hell no! No! Technical difficulties. So now with my damp sponge and her damp sponge, <laughs> we're gonna blend it in. So the primer is very luminizing. Like, why don't I have that effect? I don't know, but I don't know if I like it or not. I have oily skin and. It looks good. Anyway. <laughs> it looks good. To conceal and highlight the face, I'm going to use the Catrice <coughs> Liquid Camouflage Concealer. And Emily is going to use the Shape Tape to highlight. I just put some on my chin, on the bridge of my nose, a little bit on my forehead, and then under the eyes. powder for the under eyes and the face um, we're gonna be using the pretty vulgar both of us the translucent powder and I'm gonna use this brush for my under eyes and then the little yeah this little like powder puff thing for the rest of the face I 
I just love it so much. A little bit. So Emily didn't bring a bronzer brush. <laughs> and a so, bronze. Yeah. <laughs> So she's gonna try it out with this brush and she's gonna be using the NYX um, matte bronzer. And I'm gonna be using the NYC Smooth Skin bronzer, whatever, the bronzer, the NYC bronzer and the Wet n Wild Angle brush. We're gonna put it on our cheekbones, on our jawline, our forehead, and then we'll be contouring the nose afterwards. To contour our nose, I left my nose contour brush upstairs and I really don't want to go get it, so. <laughs> it's <laughs> okay, gonna, I'm using this yeah, one. <laughs> we're gonna make this one. We're <laughs> improvising at this point. I'm gonna be using this brush that I use for my shadow for my nose contour because I'm the one upstairs. So I just get like a little and then go like down the sides of your nose but don't go too wide because then you're gonna make your nose look bigger so, so like closer i get like i see right here like these lines that reflect mm -hmm. and i just do that yeah like you want to try to get as close as possible and connect it to your eyebrow <laughs> Grab the foundation sponge and then just go over it. For blush, we are using different blushes. So I'm using this note blush and she's using the Laura Geller one and we're both using the Real Techniques blush brush. And Mine is just a little dirty. I like to just like press on the skin, like just towards the back. Okay, so for highlighter, I'm gonna use the Oath. <laughs> for highlighter, I'm gonna use the Ofra highlighter in glazed donut. And, and then I'm gonna used. use the Amrazi Anastasia highlight. And I'm using the Anastasia 23 brush. Oh, I'm using this Sephora um, fan, fan brush. brush. For our nose and our inner corner, we're gonna use these small brushes from Lexi. Oh, look at the nose. For my inner corner, I like to just grab some highlight and then spray it with a setting spray or any kind of spray. It just makes it pop more. <laughs> keep it a little neutral because you know we have a lot on the eyes and we're both using the Huda Beauty liquid matte in the shade bombshell and then I'm gonna be going in with this lip gloss by Colourpop in the shade bestie and then she's gonna use the Fenty Beauty lip gloss it's called fussy the finished look you know very glam for new year's and she actually did a pretty good job oh, for being a beginner <laughs> that's pretty good so if you guys like this video you can always subscribe up here i'm gonna put like a little thing like my face over here so you can subscribe <laughs> <laughs> and then um you know give it a thumbs up 
if you liked it and i'll be putting my social media below as well as her social media below so you guys can follow us and talk to us and all of that but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and see you next week